Our advanced holistic program will address the underlying cause or multiple causes of your health condition with comprehensive testing using natural therapies that work with your body. There are two doctors in our clinic, myself and Dr. Imber, and we specialize in neurometabolic therapy. I am board certified in integrative medicine. I am a chiropractic physician, and I've been in practice for 30 years. Dr. Imber is a diplomate in functional neurology, one of only 11 in the state of Illinois. He is board certified in integrative medicine, and he is a chiropractic physician also. As holistic physicians, we evaluate, manage, and balance the different systems of the body and how they interact together. First, we need to arrive at a proper diagnosis. Number two, find the underlying cause or multiple causes of your health condition. And number three, manage that with natural therapies that work with your body. Now, medications can relieve symptoms, but don't really get to the cause of the problem and usually have side effects. There are tests that we recommend to determine the underlying cause or multiple causes of your health condition. First is a complete blood metabolic panel, which includes inflammatory markers, blood sugar, vitamin D, proteins, anemia, cholesterol. There's 49 tests all together in our extensive panel. Next is intestinal permeability or leaky gut syndrome testing. Leaky gut syndrome is highly associated with digestive disorders, food sensitivities, as well as autoimmune conditions. If you have leaky gut syndrome and you do not address it, your autoimmune condition or digestive disorder may never heal. Next, we do genetic testing. This can help us determine what conditions you are prone to. Uh, there are many different symptoms and conditions that you are prone to because of these imbalances, and this testing will help us determine what we can do to help balance that. Saliva hormone testing for stress hormones such as cortisol, DHEA, as well as estrogen, progesterone, and testosterone. Stool analysis testing for gut infections. If you have bacterial, yeast, or parasitic infections in the gut, it not only can lead to digestive disorders, but also a weakening of the immune system. Next are food allergy and food sensitivity testing. If you have any food allergies or sensitivities, this will again lead to digestive disorders and autoimmune conditions. Nutrient and toxic substance testing, uh, the nutrients such as magnesium, zinc, and selenium, it's telling us how much of these nutrients are actually inside the cells doing work, not just floating around in the blood, and toxic substances like mercury, lead, aluminum, and cadmium, because these toxic substances can directly attack your organs such as the brain and thyroid, as well as generally weakening your immune system. And last are our organic acid tests. This is to determine energy production in the body. Chronic health diseases. 133 million Americans have a chronic disease. If you are suffering with a chronic health condition and it is having a major impact on your life and your current or previous treatment hasn't helped, it's time to try our unique, natural approach to chronic health problems. Now some health statistics. The U.S. makes up 5% of the world's population and we take 50% of the prescription drugs worldwide, but we are ranked 37th overall in health. Something just is not working right here. Billions of dollars are spent on medication research each year, but the rates of chronic diseases are not declining. Medications address the symptoms of chronic health conditions. They have side effects and they don't deal with the cause. Just a little test here. We'd like you to name two things that you can do right now to improve your health. So I'll stop for a few seconds. Now, when I ask my patients this, most people say, improve my diet, 
exercise, better sleep, lower my stress. Nobody I've ever asked this question to, question to says I need to take more medications. Now, neurometabolic therapy is our specialty. So what we do is uh, first we want to do a comprehensive history and evaluation. Then we will run the necessary lab tests, some of, some of which you probably haven't had. And we need to find the underlying cause or multiple causes of your health condition. Now, the neuro part of the neurometabolic is your nervous system. It controls 100% of your body's functions. It is imperative that your nervous system be evaluated and improved in order to get maximum results. The metabolic part is evaluating and managing your digestive system, immune system, hormones, and diet. And that is what our neurometabolic therapy is all about. Now, the nervous system and the brain, the brain makes up 3% of our body weight, but it consumes 20 to 30% of our body's energy, which is what we call metabolism. Abnormal metabolism means abnormal brain function. The metabolic systems in the brain work hand in hand. Your brain controls every single part of your body, including the immune system and your digestive system and uh, blood pressure and heart rate and digestion, everything's controlled by your nervous system, which is why we add this into our neurometabolic program. Now, the metabolic therapy is, uh, we start with the gut. The gut, as Hippocrates, the father of medicine, said, look to the gut for the cause of most human illnesses. Your gastrointestinal system is a tube. It also is a barrier. Any breakdown in this barrier, something we call leaky gut syndrome or intestinal permeability in the gut leads to serious health problems. It can cause dysbiosis, which involves infections and imbalances and good bacteria in the gut. We need to run specific tests on your gut to find the cause. This could be infections like parasites, yeast, or bacterial and these imbalances as well in the good bacteria or what we know as probiotics. Our tests can tell exactly what probiotics you need as well. Your gut makes up 80% of your immune system due to the fact of the uh, immunity and the good bacteria and due to the fact that there's a barrier between your gut and your bloodstream and if you break this barrier down it's going to lead to immune imbalances. So GI imbalances can lead to serious autoimmune disorders. As a matter of fact, leaky gut syndrome is what happens first that leads to the immune imbalance. Once you break down the gut, you leak toxins from your gut into your bloodstream, which just weakens your immune system over time. Now, autoimmune disorders are named for the tissue that they your own immune system attacks. So your immune system is supposed to protect you and when it breaks down and starts attacking you you're in trouble when it attacks a specific tissue we just put a name on that if it attacks your joints it's rheumatoid arthritis if it attacks your thyroid it's graves disease or hashimoto's if it attacks your organs it's lupus and on and on if you just treat the symptoms and you don't address the immune system or the cause you may never get better and lastly, your nervous system controls your gastrointestinal system, your immune system, uh, the release of hormones, every function in your body. The immune system. Many chronic health conditions are due to a weakening in the immune system. We have to evaluate the gut or your digestive system since it makes up 80% of your immune system. It is a barrier, and if you break down the barrier, it's going to weaken your immune system and leak toxins into the bloodstream. The frontline defense of your immune system is called Th1 and Th2. Th1 is comprised of your white blood cells, while Th2 are your antibodies. We need to find out the dominant side, especially in autoimmune patients. There should be a balance between Th1 and Th2, if you have an immune imbalance or chronic health condition, autoimmune condition, one of these sides are dominant. 
So for example, vitamin C strengthens your white blood cells. If you are Th1 dominant and you take a lot of vitamin C, it may weaken your immune system. Now Th3 or the T regulatory cells control Th1 and Th2. And Th3 is modulated by many nutrients like vitamin D as well as omega-3 essential fatty acids. Th17 controls Th3 and thus secondarily Th1 and Th2. This entire system must be evaluated and managed to balance the immune system and we do this on a natural level. Also your immune system is controlled by your nervous system. Hormones. So let's take a look at the endocrine system. Hormones are some of the most powerful substances in your body. Think of thyroid hormone controlling your metabolism when it's very low, your fatigued, weight gain, uh, constipation, brain fog, poor mental focus, everything slows down in the body. Also think of adrenaline. You almost get in a car accident, all of a sudden, quickly within seconds, your heart is racing. So these are very power powerful chemicals in our bodies. Your brain, the hypothalamus, controls your pituitary gland, which in turn controls all the glands in the body that produce hormones. So the thyroid for thyroid hormone, the pancreas for insulin and blood sugar regulation, uh, the adrenal glands for cortisol, DHEA, regulating your stress response, the gonads for estrogen and testosterone, the pineal gland releasing melatonin for sleep. Now these glands also communicate with each other chemically. So a holistic approach that manages the interactions of all these glands is necessary. Diet and toxins. We are bombarded with toxins, thousands of toxins and chemicals throughout our life. They are in our food, our water, the air, personal care products. Also, heavy metals uh, that are in, in these, uh, the air and water, they all poison our bodies. We all need to detoxify our bodies, but if it's not done properly, it can actually worsen your condition. So a caution here is don't just jump in head first and try a detoxification program. If your body is too weak, if you cannot handle it, if your digestion cannot get rid of these toxins, if you have an autoimmune condition, and you are weak, if you try to detox, it will make you worse. Diet. So we look at uh, a poor diet leads to ill health, leads to chronic health conditions. Trans fats or poor fats block nutrition into our cells of our body, the trillions of cells that we have, and it blocks the waste products from coming out. Uh, the increase in the amount of sugar that we've uh, consumed over the decades leads to inflammation and dysglycemia or diabetes, insulin resistance, metabolic syndrome, hypoglycemia. This is one of the biggest stressors on our body. That is when our sugar is out of balance. In the year 1900, the average person consumed five pounds of sugar per year. The year 2000, that increased to 150 pounds way too much and it's having serious health consequences. 70 health conditions are linked to excessive sugar consumption. Processed foods and high empty calorie diets lead to obesity. Today, one in three people are obese. 50 years ago, it was one in 10. Let's summarize our natural holistic therapy program. Holistic therapy first involves attaining a proper diagnosis, then finding and managing the underlying cause or multiple causes of your condition, and balancing it with natural therapies that work with your body. If you do not find the cause, you may never get better. Metabolic means balancing the gastrointestinal system, the immune system, the endocrine or hormone system, and balancing diet, what you should or should not eat, as well as evaluating four toxins that can run the immune system down and weaken the body in general. Neurologic therapy is necessary since your brain controls all bodily functions. 
our unique comprehensive neurometabolic therapy program can give you optimal results. So the commitment to our program involves a few different things. Number one, lifestyle changes. You cannot continue to eat the same foods. If you have a chronic health condition, we need to get rid of foods that are, are causing imbalances in the body, weakening your immune system, whether it's food sensitivities or allergies, or just foods that you may not be allergic to, but inherently they're high in toxins, chemicals, and sugar. Time. Uh, you're going to need to commit time because you're going to have to come in for therapy appointments. And three, you're going to make a financial commitment. Your insurance may pay for some of our program. We will discuss the cost details at your first appointment. If your health condition is having a major negative impact on your life and your current treatment is not working, we want you to know there is hope. We are offering a free 30-minute phone consultation. This allows you to ask questions about our program and talk specifically about your chronic health condition. You can reach us at 630-257-0550. We look forward to talking to you and meeting you. Have a great day.